You know, one of the things that breaks my heart, uh, being a 41-year-old man living in the United States of America, is the way that people suffer with their own self-image. You know, I have an advertising degree, it's my first degree, and all the products tell you, you need this to be happy, and, and so many products tell you, like the advertisers tell you, you need this to be beautiful. And the evil one wants people to just have a distaste for their life. Uh, I think a body dysmorphia is the way that it's sometimes described. Psalm 139 tells us something else. The Lord tells us something else in Psalm 139 that can renew our minds. Truly you have formed me in my inmost being. You knit me in my mother's womb. I give you thanks that I am fearfully, wonderfully made. Wonderful are your works. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. The renewal of the mind principle at work here is to know that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. It's not what the advertisers tell you that makes you beautiful. It's God who says, you're my son, you're my daughter, you're beautiful. Doesn't matter if you're going bald. Doesn't matter if you're like, I wish I had a few less pounds. Jesus loves you perfectly and you are fearfully and wonderfully made and he wants you to walk in that. So start praying, Jesus, help me to know how much you love me, every inch of me, head to toe. Jesus, help me to know how much you love me, every inch of me, from head to toe, and live in the freedom of the renewal of the mind of how God sees you. God bless you, friends.